Hello, this is just a quick video on how to download and install the Qt wallet to get it synced and working very quickly. First of all, we need to download the wallet. Go to the website, choose the wallet for our operating system. I'm going to use the Windows one. Okay. Then we need to extract it. Here, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drag the Qt file to the desktop to make life a bit easier. And then I'm going to set the wallet up using the default settings. Use the default data directory, create a new wallet. Now here, normally we would copy the seed phrase, but for the time being we don't need it at the moment, so I'm just going to click OK. Create a password. OK, now the wallet is done. But what we need to do is we need to add the bootstrap. So I'm going to shut this down. Wait for that to close. Head back to the website and go to the auto bootstrap because on Windows this is a very good tool. So once that's downloaded, extract that. We just want to run this. Now, because we chose the default settings, this should work straight away. Okay, now the wallet's going to restart. Once we're here, we click on Tools, Show Privacy Coin Folder, then shut the wallet down. What we're going to do now is delete everything except the block contain state folders. Shut this down. Now restart the wallet. Should ask us if you want to create a new wallet or recover. We're going to create a new wallet. Now this time we need to make a note of our seed phrase. So we copy that and I'm just going to paste it here temporarily. Set our password. Now it's done, we just wait for some connections and we're fully synced and ready to go. It's just finishing off the syncing now. So now you'll be able to click on receive, get your address, send some coins to it and then enable staking if that's what you need to do. Okay, thanks for watching.